guys, what's going on? We are just arriving into Cabo, which is the first stop of our seven day cruise via Navigator of the Seas. So I'll be taking you on shore and video uh, everything that we experience. All right, so here is the excursion that we're doing. Cabo Sightseeing Tour. And it's worth noting that our ship is tendering, which means that they're not actually docking. They are parking their butts in the middle of the ocean, really, like maybe uh, offshore a couple miles, and we're having to take a tender from the ship to the actual shore. So that'll be part of the shore process that you'll see in the video. So before you go on shore, you have a choice. You can go to the Windjammer on 11, or you can go to the main dining area for brunch. And that's what we're doing right now. Have a quick bite to eat before we leave. Sure, Eggs Benedict, guys, and it is as good as it looks. All right, so we have about an hour until we get on the tender, but here is the view, and I'll shoot the other side also, but this is where we're at in Cabo. There's a private yacht out there, somebody's. So I'm on the other side of the ship. Pretty cool rock formations. And then it goes back into shore. Kind of cut off by the ship here, but not a bad view. You see all the tenders just waiting to pick a lot of people up and take them. A lot of activity. Pretty cool to see all the boats out. clip will be offloading and seeing what's on shore. Cabo San Lucas, Navigator of the Seas. Number nine, so for the tendering right? process, they had everybody meet in the Royal Theater on deck three and you just gotta have your ship's pass card and your tickets and then they're gonna take us to the tender now. Down on the first deck here, waiting to get onto one of the tenders. So watch your step getting onto the tender, but we are here guys. Getting off the tender, watch your step, guys. It's a little shaky. If you like the video so far, hit the like button. Don't forget, it helps YouTube algorithm so people will find this. Uh, let's see what Cabo has to offer. Just follow their instructions. You'll put a sticker on your shirt. You'll be a certain number, and just follow the crap.
Hopefully I don't get a copyright on the music, otherwise I'll have to edit this, but I'm trying to get y'all an idea of what to see off of the ship when you get off the tender. There's a guy at the front of the line holding up a placard of the number for your group, so just make sure you pay attention and don't lose him. Pretty much you're like ants, you're just being shuffled through to your shuttles. Here's our tour bus for the day. Nice aqua blue. Should be fun. I'll get a good cheer here. On the left side, there is a hotel area. The first hotel is located in this one. And there is a community called El Padre Galmin, La Ucabora, Wilkins Mosa, Teacher. And right here, start or end the highway number one. There is the reference points, the reference point for the beginning or the end of the highway. Right in the left. No? Okay. Me too either. No. Los Cabos mean is the capes. The capes divide into town. Cabo San Lucas, where is the very tip of the Baja Peninsula, where we are located right now. Where is located the famous Arch, Lowers Bridge. Cabo San Lucas is a little more touristic than San Jose del Cabo. You will see when we be there. Okay? San Jose del Cabo is a little more charming or Mexican style. This where is located one of the missions building for the Jesuits on the century 17. Right now, there is a commercial area. You see restaurants, bars, young stays, handcuffs, and a lot of things that you can see right now. There is a commercial area, a lot of pharmacies too also. Yeah. Why we have a lot of pharmacies here? Because the United States to buy those drugs. <laughs> to buy legal drugs, yeah. that's correct. Yeah. Yeah. No, because time ago, some of the tourists yeah. forget the prescription yeah. medicine. Yeah. And now they have more opportunity to buy this kind of the medicine without prescription. That's why you can see a lot of pharmacies around yeah. here. But it's important that you go into these pharmacy stores. Because if you're going to the pharmacy, pharmacia in Mexico or local pharmacia, they request the prescription for the medicine that you want. And if you can buy, Wherever you want, any amount. Okay? Some of this, they have a good price for buy the medicine. Right here, I call the wild area. Why I call wild area? Because there is a lot of bars located in this part of the town. Mighty on the screen break. This area is very, very crowded on the night. There is a famous street road bar. And on the right side, coming up, one of the, and the unique shopping mall that we have in Los Cabos, this shopping mall called Puerto Paraíso. In this area, you can find fancy brands. Fancy brands, we're talking about those, those, Salvatore Ferragamo, Fenty, uh, Cartier, and more of these famous brands for the rich, rich people use. Uh, rest of this 
Indians, they expect me that in this area, there is part of the one of the cemetery that is cool. Because they find uh, bones, heads, and legs. They are a little more bigger than the nose. They are close to 76, 78. This one is safe. There is place between in two waters. Why? Because the other side is the Pacific and on this side is the Sea of Cortes. This is the signification of this word. There is no much, too much words from this time, but there is just a few. And then if you see almost in front of us the most of the buildings, there is some possessed and Tamo in Paris. Okay? And on the right side there is a estuary. This estuary has a natural spring water. In this time of the year, there is a lot of emigration birds. These birds coming from South America, North America, Canada. They come here, have the berries, and there is some trails for the people like it to see the birds, or watch birds. Or there is a water area for the people who want to make a work, uh, make watch bird by kayak. The other side, there is the entrance for the kayak. Just got dropped off at like a shopping plaza. Do a little bit of shopping. Silver fanatics, here's some jewelry. Uh, Local shop action. That's a little bit of scenery from the shopping area for you guys. Kind of cool. Little cart there. I don't know. Back in the day, 
I would definitely be running up there, hanging out in that tree. They give me ambulance. Yeah, lucky. I'm not gonna do it. They give me ambulance. Kind of like the little shops. A lot of silver shops, leather, leather goods. Solid leather. I have not tried to go in and negotiate yet, but if I get the opportunity, I'll definitely try. Y'all know me. Tell y'all what, I'm not the type to like, like bad mouth anything, but don't expect great prices here. I think that they um, mark it up for all the tourists because prices are a little bit high, I gotta admit. I think y'all say the same thing if you come here. I've tried to negotiate already once and they did not even think about budging, so I guess that they figure they'll find the buyer no matter what. But so far, I mean, it's pretty bare. We're the only ship in port currently today, but I got told they have two the next day and then three the next day after that, so. Amazing tours. Okay. Hoping to find a location where they have like the more mom, small mom and pops. Look at this, they're selling California license plates. <laughs> That's funny. Baja, California. Mm, silver. That swordfish was pretty cool. Hola, ¿qué pasó? ¿Qué? There's some rooms close to the ocean with a private pool. The cost per night is around 14,000 US. We also the famous people like uh, I saw in this area, Jennifer Lopez, Jennifer Aniston, John Travolta, Kevin Costner, Bruce Willis, Kobe Bryant, Michael Jordan, Tiger Woods, Bob McGuire, John Elway, stayed in this hotel on the left side. Both Las Ventanas al Paradiso. One of the exclusive resorts in Cabo Peru. for the more lowest hotel zone area. We're talking about new ones because they, these hotels, they don't have more than the four years open. These hotels have brothers in another part of the Mexico, Cancun or Puerto Vallarta.
movements, okay? Be sure that you have all your things, cellular phones, wallets, hats, bags, everything that you have, bring before that you get into the bus. And senores, I want to say thank you, thank you for coming, thank you for enjoying us. Hopefully you like the tour. If you like it, recommend us. If you don't like it, don't say nothing, please. Okay? We're going to be in the table in a three more minutes. And when you coming down, please don't forget to give me the survey that I give it to you with my pencil. As soon as we are in the harbor, there is my colleagues. They're going to give you some instructions how you get back to the pier to take the tenders. Okay, senores. Thank you. Thank you for coming. And see you the next time. Next week, next vacations, next year. Walking back towards where the tenders are, guys. Uh, in my opinion, all the shops are overpriced. So if you want to buy like souvenirs and Cabo, get ready to spend up for it because you're definitely, the only thing that was good is the local beers here were only two bucks while you're walking around. So if you like to be, drink beer, then you're in for a treat because it's pretty affordable. But other than that, man, I tell you what, overpriced on everything in the shops, be prepared. So we're on a bigger ship coming off of it for the tender. Now we're going on a smaller one. So this boat's probably gonna rock a little bit. Let's see what the adventure's like getting back to the Navigator. We're officially on the tender. Pretty cool little sunset action with the views of the boats. I'll try to get some better shots as we get.
Well, made it back onto the ship. Just always have your ship's pass. It's a pretty easy process. They scan your bags. If you have your cell phone, you gotta put it through, but nothing too crazy. Let me see if I can get you a last departing view of Cabo before I end the video. If you liked what you saw, please hit the like button. It helps me and the channel. It'd be cool of you. It's your way of saying thank you. For me making the video as well have a good time wherever you might go take care guys peace so this is